Pentagon. U.S. is ready to use nuclear weapons to protect South Korea. The United States is committed to using conventional and nuclear weapons to deter and protect South Korea. This was stated by Pentagon Chief Lloyd Austin in a joint press conference with South Korean Minister of National Defense Lee Jong-sok in Seoul. Our commitment to the defense of the Republic of Korea remains unwavering. The United States is firmly committed to extended deterrence, which involves the use of the full range of U.S. military capabilities, including conventional and nuclear weapons, as well as missile defense capabilities, the minister said. According to him, in 2022, Northern Korea committed an unprecedented number of provocations. The United States, along with South Korea, he noted, condemn these dangerous actions, which, according to the parties, destabilize the situation in the region. Austin noted that 28,500 American servicemen are serving in South Korea. This is one of the largest largest U.S. military contingents abroad. This demonstrates our unwavering commitment to maintaining peace on the Korean peninsula. Over the past year, our countries have achieved significant success in deepening cooperation. The head of the Pentagon added, stressing that the parties against the backdrop of threats from the northern Korea have stepped up response measures and are conducting exercises. 